Hi, my name is Amy Mozzie and I'm with Centurion Boats. Today I'm going to talk to you about the all new 2019 FI 25. This FI looks strikingly similar to the 23 and 21 foot versions of 2018, but this is a whopping 25 feet. It's still got that same sleek profile, that ultra wide bow, but the interior is limousine proportions. This thing is huge. Let's check it out. Just like the other Centurion FIs, the FI-25 has the Opti-V hull as its running surface. It's got 20 degrees of dead rise at the transom. What that means to you is not only does this boat displace a ton of water for a Mackin surf wave or an awesome wakeboard wake, it also handles rough water with ease. When we talk about the Opti-V hull and the fact that it's got 20 degrees of dead rise and actually displaces more water with less weight, it begs the question, well, how much ballast is in the FI-25? About 5,000 pounds, actually. So you're gonna be creating a huge wave, but more importantly, you're gonna do it quickly because with the ram fill system, that weight enters the boat in about 90 seconds. So in about 90 seconds, you've got a world championship wake surf wave, thanks to ram fill. So once you're set up, your ram fill is full, you're ready to surf, all you have to do is make one button press on the dash and activate Quick Surf. Quick Surf has two blades on either corner of the transom of the boat that actually create lift opposite the surf side and displace water on the side that you're surfing on. What this allows you to do is actually switch from a goofy side wave to a regular side wave in about 1.8 seconds. When we say quick surf, that's what we mean. So the Stinger wake plate on the back of the FI-25 actually changes the running attitude of the boat. It either gets the nose down into the water so that the most aggressive part of the V can cut through the chop, or it can change the shape, fine tune it a bit for your wave or your wakeboard wake. We also have a version of the Stinger wake plate that we call the Silent Stinger. It actually cuts down the engine noise of the boat as well as dissipates the, any line from your exhaust interfering with a surf wave or a wakeboard wake. That makes everything extra quiet on the inside. As we get in the boat, it doesn't just feel like a limousine because of the mass of the interior, it's also some of the amenities. So the vinyl, it's 17 mil top coat. It's comfort strong vinyl but in this FI-25, they've chosen the optional all hex vinyl, which means all of the interior has a cool texture to it, hexagon pattern, it feels nice, it actually dissipates the heat really well so it doesn't get as hot even with darker colors. So one thing you're never missing in an FI-25 are cup holders, even on the back of the boat. We've got a couple on the swim step and as you get inside, there's a total of 23 that you can have in this boat and you've always got easy access to the drinks that go in the cup holders because the ice chest is built into the floor. So you don't have to have anybody get up from their seat to grab a drink. It's convenient and there's a ton. So all of the luxuries and the amenities that you find in an FI-25 are nothing compared to the new hinged storage access. And not only are the seats hinged, they're actually removable hinges. So you can get back there and clean behind that seat and still have the convenience of opening with one hand and accessing your storage without having to remove a cushion all the way. The FI-25 also has an optional four position slide seat. This seat stows at the rear of the lounge, but can be mounted or slid to four different positions in the center of the lounge. You can also add a lean back and face backwards, watch your rider, or slide the seat all the way forwards, put the lean back on the other side, face forward with your driver. It's also got an optional table that can mount in any of the four receptacles on the slide seat. So new for 2019 is the optional drop zone auto tower. This tower is unique for a number of reasons. First one is strength. The water drop extrusion that the tower is built with is 40% stronger than a typical tube tower. It's also extremely quiet. It doesn't rattle, doesn't make a noise, but then you can actually collapse it with a button press. It's 10 seconds down, 14 seconds up. It's done with a worm drive. 
It doesn't vibrate, it doesn't bind. This tower is as strong as it is beautiful and it does everything it needs to do, collapsed or up. So also exclusive to Centurion by Roswell Marine is the new bombshell rack. This rack is unique because it swivels. It'll hold a very, very wide uh, custom surfboard, but at the same time, it's got quarter inch foam along the forks of these racks that actually dissipates any pressure that's created when the rack is holding a board in place. So it doesn't puncture or dent, especially that custom board that you just paid so much money for that's your new baby. It's gonna be safe in the bombshell rack. So for 2019, not only can you upgrade to the new Drop Zone Tower by Roswell, you can also upgrade to Roswell's Crossfire speaker system that's exclusive to Centurion as well. This speaker system is unique in that it covers the entire lounge of the boat with sound, but that sound is controlled independently from the speakers that are firing back to the rider. So you don't have to blow everybody out on the interior of the boat to get that crisp, clean sound back to that guy doing that trick he's never done behind the boat. So not only is the drop zone tower exclusive to Centurion and manufactured by Roswell, it's got some really cool features and options that are also unique to this auto tower. One of the things I really love is the hangers. So I've actually got four different points I can hang life vests, wet life vests, towels, uh, ropes that are already tied up. Uh, it's really convenient. You've also got surf tow points. So I've got a goofy side and a regular side surf tow point. This is awesome for teaching beginners to surf. It gets them in the wave as they start off, which I love. But the other thing that I think is super cool, it's an option on this tower, is you can match the gel coat of your boat to the tower shields for the drop zone. So it can be a custom look as well as very, very usable features. The drop zone tower has a choice when it comes to the bimini. You can get the large version, which basically starts at the rear hoop and goes forward to the windshield, or you can get the double XL bimini, which folds out towards the back and covers almost the entire lounge, even in an FI-25. This bimini is not only has a lot of coverage, it also has surf storage up top. I can't think of a better way to get some shade on the water. The Touch Vision Split HD screen in the FI series is as beautiful as it is functional. It's a touch screen and it's got more of a panoramic view to it. I've got five button navigation on the left and I can easily get to any one of the boat's systems and it's very, very visible. The text is large, you're not searching and taking your eyes off the water when you're trying to do something in an FI series boat. One of the greatest features of Centurion boats in general, and especially the FI-25, is the fact that it has no bow rise when you take off. You never lose sight of the horizon when you're driving. And that's largely because of Quick Launch. And Quick Launch is available on your touchscreen, and really with one button press and you can activate it, all three blades in the back go down. So your center stinger wake plate and your two quick surf plates go down to 100% until you get onto plane. And this pretty much eliminates bow rise altogether. So you never have to worry about not seeing the water that's in front of you. There are as many as seven different ballast locations in the FI-25. And it's not just those locations, but the placement of weight that makes a big difference in this boat. So in a lot of boats, you'll get all of your weight behind the back seat of the boat. So it makes the nose of the boat rise up. In an FI-25, you've actually got ballast weight in the bow, in the walkthrough, you've got ram fill tanks that extend from the driver's seat all the way back to the transom, then you've got weight on either side of the engine and another optional ballast bag in the trunk. So we've distributed the weight so that you can run more level in the water and have more customization with your wakes or your waves. So the first two things you notice about an FI series boat when you lay eyes on it is the sleekness of the profile and the wideness of the bow. The bow in these things is huge. It's got room for at least three people and comfortably. That's one of the things that really sets the FI apart as far as style and comfort. 
So that's it for the walkthrough of the all new 2019 Centurion FI25. But that's not where this story ends. We've got your number. No matter what is important to you on the water, we encourage you to visit your nearest dealer and let us prove it to you today.